obviously a big thanks to my buddy, Dr. Chad Wilder, who I'm actually here at your Black Ops Center. Yes. Yes. So uh, we've got a cool training for you guys today. And um, anyway, thanks again, Dr. Wilner. You are so welcome. Appreciate it, buddy. All right, let's go ahead. So uh, for those of you who may not know me, I want to do a quick little intro. This is not going to be all about me, but just so you, just so you know who I am. Uh, my name is Sam Carlson, and uh, I've been an entrepreneur, a lifelong entrepreneur. I always tell people I never really had a job. Uh, my last job was uh, a bank teller when I was in college. So that's been long enough now that uh, I consider myself a lifelong entrepreneur. I've been in the digital marketing space uh, for about five years. Um, and I actually had some experience back in the early 2000s as well with digital marketing back when it was a budding and a new space uh, from what it is today. Um, at one, I, I uh, had a top rated podcast called the Next Level Facebook Ads Podcast. This was actually a, in the topic of Facebook ads. It was top three in the world for downloaded podcasts in the subject matter. So um, that is, uh, it's something fun I did with a friend and uh, it's, it grew to be pretty big. So, and then um, our agency, 25th West was my previous agency and we still own that agency. But as you see during this presentation, we've kind of taken a different route, but we were the only agency that ever had a case study published by Facebook. This is uh, um, something that, uh, you know, is a feather in our cap and it's something that we bring into this new venture. So uh, can everybody hear me? I know that when we were uh, doing that introduction slide, that uh, there was no sound. Can you guys hear me? Thank you, Chris. I appreciate you giving me a verification there. All right, so let's get started. I've got a promise I want to make to you guys today because I know you're spending your time here today as well as uh, you're giving something up to, to see what potential we can bring to your uh, clinic today. So instead of just share another marketing quote secret, right, which is in effect just a veiled sales pitch, I'm going to show you, I'm actually going to demonstrate a software that puts the power of new patient marketing in your hands. It literally does that and it does not require utility of a Facebook ad agency. Okay. And you know, you don't need to be techie. You don't ever have to create your own creative slash ads or marketing funnel. So yes, you are going to see um, how we can, how you can get new patients with ease. You're going to see proven niche ads as well as funnels. I'm going to explain how and why they work. And you'll, you might ask, why would I do that? I think during the presentation, you will see why I'm willing to do that. And then um, I'm going to show you how you can save thousands of dollars um, in your marketing. Okay. This is a, a big promise, but hopefully we can live. We'll have to see how we do here at the end here, but uh, okay. So warning, you know, we don't, the, the people who want something for nothing, this is not for you. This is a powerful tool. Okay. But it only works if you do, this is not a get rich quick scheme. So if you came to see, uh, Hey, how do I just, you know, flip the switch and nothing, I don't have to do anything else. You might want to just bail early. This is not for you. Okay. Assuming we're here to see a, a proven system, let's get into this thing. Okay. We need to establish some, uh, some hard truths here. Okay. Unfortunately, the crowd that I come from, the digital marketing crowd isn't the greatest. I mean, that's an understatement. I know a lot of you, <laughs> Dr. Wilner is smiling as uh, I'm saying this. Uh, a lot of you have had experiences like the ones I'm about to show you. Um, I have a, a collection here of the audience that is selling their services to you. Here's a couple of example, uh, examples. I'm sure you guys have seen or maybe been down this road. And in the comments, if you have anything you want to add, go ahead, feel free. But this fella, <laughs> I'm meeting with my first chiropractor tomorrow. What's a good offer to provide to potential patients of a chiropractor? It's launched. This, this was actually in, in my Facebook group. Uh, it's launched for my uh, chiropractor. What conversion rate uh, would be good? What should I expect? How do I know if it's good or if it's bad? Help, I'm launching my first funnel for a chiropractor, but I'm struggling with ad copy and ad, and ad agency people out there care to, don't care to share their best ad copy for a chiropractor. Does anyone have a good funnel? I mean, this thing just keeps going on and on. I mean, and then this was, uh, this was a, a, a little nugget. And uh, this is in here. Dr. Wolner actually sent this to me. Okay, this was not mine, but... This was a direct message from the quote, queen of funnels. 
Okay. The queen of funnels reached out to my friend and I, I, I got rid of your name here cause I didn't want to. Okay. So hi, Chad, love what you're doing. I heard you were going, uh, you were the go-to create a uh, guy for creating funnels for Kairos, right? I have a new client. I'm wondering if you can send me an example of high converted funnel you use. I'm happy to pay. Thanks in advance. Uh, she's the queen of funnels, you guys, but she's, uh, apparently she's not the queen. Oh, she never paid. Okay. So exactly. Uh, all right. Why? This is the question. Why, why is this? Why is it that there's such this ridiculous group of people? Well, I'll simplify it to a, a pretty, and I mean, this, this is <laughs> a big reason why. Um, but let me kind of give you some backstory. This guy right here, his name is Dan Henry. Now, Dan Henry, uh, a few years ago, four or five years ago, something like that, had a program called How to Choose Easy Facebook Ad Clients. So he would, and you notice where his hand is pointed at right there? It's at Cairo, right? Kairos. Okay. So he basically um, gave ever the, everybody the idea that, hey, just use the ads that I'm going to get and you'll get leads, use the funnels that I'm gonna give you, and you'll get leads, and then all you gotta do is go and party. You look at them once a month, you're good to go, your clients are getting leads, you are rich. And the problem is, is this worked until it didn't. I mean, the reality is, is Dan left something really, really paramount, really big out of this equation, and that is this. Ads must be supervised, and managed to maintain performance. So what happened was thousands of people, this guy made a lot of money. I mean, he's no schlub when it comes to business. Thousands of people bought this course and went on vacation and spent that hard earned money, right? Hard earned. And then after a small amount of time, it wasn't a month after a small amount of time, all of their ads stopped performing. And what you were left with was a group full of people that had no idea what to do after they had actually launched these campaigns. Basically, the blind meaning the blind. But here's the truth. Dan was actually onto something. He knew that if you had proven ads, proven marketing, or what we call control funnels, that that would be part of the puzzle. But the last piece that he omitted was effective management. All right, cool. So here's what we're going to show you today. Thanks, thanks for indulging me for a little bit of backstory. It is important to understand where we're coming from to know how we're going to solve the problem for you guys. So we're going to show you proven ads and control funnels, niche specific marketing examples. We're going to show you in part two, marketing automation and follow up uh, chasing leads, uh, I guess is fun for some people, but uh, we don't want we want to stop doing that. And we want to improve our show rates as well. And then part three is something we call click campaigns, as well as a Facebook demo. Because honestly, and I can tell you until I'm blue in the face how awesome this stuff is, but I'd rather just show you. Fair enough, you guys? All right, let's jump into part one. So how do you create a killer ad campaign? I'm, I'm going to share with you guys a, a framework that will have you creating better ads than any agency you have ever worked with. Okay, let's start with a quote. When you speak to everybody or everyone, you speak to no one. I have people all the time when we start this, and this is less, I think people are wising up to this, but more so maybe a couple of years ago, and they would say, hey, we offer all of these things. Let's put that in the ad. Well, here's the reality. If you speak to everyone, your marketing will not work. A niche specific marketing campaign is paramount to having any level of success. So your ads need to focus on a niche. Okay. Another quote, a lot of times people don't know what they want until you show them. Okay. Steve Jobs said that he came up with some pretty cool stuff. I think uh, one of the things that positions you as different as new is something that is novel, something that is demonstrable. You ever heard people say demonstrable? That's a tough one. Okay. Novel, demonstrable. This, this allows you to create curiosity and hack the education process. Okay. Another quote, people don't buy products. They buy solutions. All right. 
this is a really important, this might be, as far as a starting point, this might be the most important thing to internalize when you're creating your own ads. People don't care as much about your thing. They don't, unless you, you frame it around a problem that you can solve. So if your ad copy, if your messaging focuses so much on how you're amazing, on how you're the number one rated chiropractor and the whatever, you know, and you've got all these, people don't care about that. They don't care about how great your thing is until it's framed around solving their particular problem. All right. This is something I call my marketing triad. There's more when, when you're creating an ad, you can get really kinky. And I mean, it's like anything else. It's 80% of the, of the equation. So this is where I come up with the bulk of my ideas and my angles when I'm creating, um, when I'm creating new ads. Let me ask you guys, uh, what do you think about this, about this approach, about what you've just heard, what you've just learned? Have you ever heard anything like this before? Does this make sense to you? Give me a yes, give me something in the comments. Let me know if this is pretty cool. Cause honestly, I used to, people used to pay me to teach them how to create ads for this type of thing. Give me a comment. Let me know that, uh, that you're there. Let me know that uh, you are digging what we've got. Yes. Okay, cool. Very good. Let's, let's jump into a couple of, of ad examples. Let's see how well we actually did here. All right. Remember, we've got a couple of, in that triad, we've got a couple of points to focus on. All right. These are some actual campaigns or some actual ads. And we've got plenty of examples that you'll see um, today, but these are some actual campaigns that we've used to get spinal decompression. Uh, I'm guessing how many here are doing spinal decompression or, or some type of uh, distraction um, in their uh, clinic. Okay, cool. Yes, no, yes, yes. All right. Um, so if you look at the top left, it says two back treatments for, for decompression. Okay. You go down, uh, or actually, let's go to the right. Uh, correct bulging disc, eliminate sciatica pain. Well, let's go through real quick and see kind of what we're doing here. First of all, is it niche? Yes, we are speaking to people. So the one on the left is less niche because it's focusing just on back pain, right? And back pain, while a lot of people have back pain, they call it different things. So correct bulging disc. A lot of people know, uh, you know that term and they might identify with that. Sciatica, that's very niche specific. Is it novel? Well, the status quo for bulging disc is surgery. So this is different. This is a different approach. And then is it a solution? Our messaging is framed around an actual solution here. Okay, makes sense. So I think we've we've checked off the three macro bo uh, buckets here. So let's keep let's keep moving. And then uh, this is a control funnel. <clears throat> so a control funnel. By the way, um, if you don't know what the word control, it means proven. All right, and. A control funnel is your proven funnel until another funnel can beat it, all right? If this thing will produce leads at 20 bucks, whatever the cost is, depending on your specific market, and you can't beat it, well, then this becomes the control, okay? And this control funnel is there to get the lead, get conversions. All right, let's jump into another example. Um, how many offering uh, knee decompression? I love knee decompression, by the way. If you don't, if you're not offering knee decompression, you don't know about it. Um, there's a great company called Ergoflex. I get zero dollars by telling you how awesome I think they are. But if you're doing anything for knee um, or if you're doing like anything regenerative, knee decompression is a great way to get them in the door. All right. Um, so here's another one. Um, is this niche? Is it novel? Is it a solution? It is niche because we're focusing on the knee. Okay, we're talking about a specific problem. Is it novel? Yes. Once again, it's going away from the, <clears throat> excuse me, it's going away from the, you know, the assumed solution, which is surgery. Okay. Knee, re knee replacement. And then as a solution, yeah, the thing is it's built around solving a problem. So people who have knee issues and they're scrolling through their feed, when they see this, they're going to identify, self-identify with this offer. Okay. Here's another control funnel. Now, um, <clears throat> I should do it to where I can play the video on the left, 
Um, I'm not going to do that just in, in the interest of time, but this is a great uh, control funnel. I know it looks, this one in particular looks relatively simple. The thing has been converting for, I don't know, two years. So it does very well. It's a great funnel, all right? So this is pretty cool. I mean, you guys have gotten to see behind the curtain of some of the top notch, and this is only a couple of examples, but you know, we have a lot more than just spinal decompression and knee decompression. We also have chiropractic, tendonitis. In fact, we, in fact the, the tendonitis is one that we just released this week into our program. Neuropathy, weight loss with a contour light or other red light therapies, ADD, ADHD, regenerative medicine. And that list is growing all the time. Okay, it's pretty exciting. Cool. So let's stop real quick. So part one is all about identifying what's going to get the right people to raise their hand and how to create a winning formula. Okay. Part two, automation and follow up. Let me pose this question. How important is the follow up process in getting new patients? How important is the follow up process in sales? Well, I'm sure a lot of you have seen, you know, these types of statistics. Uh, thank you, Gary. Absolutely. It's extremely important. But there's two, there's two stats in here that if they don't scare you, then you don't own a business. You don't actually own a business. You're just showing up. Okay. Half of the salespeople never follow up with a prospect. This is across the board. And when it comes to leads over my five years of doing this, that's, this is generous. Okay. And then the second one, this one is really, I mean, if you want to know where you've been missing out on your money, 80% of sales are made on the fifth to 12th contract. And you know, it's, it's interesting. This was reported. The source is the national sales executive association. So these are stats and people can use stats to do different things, but I have a back desk and I have a, or a, a back office access and I can see of the over 100 clinics that are using patient stream right now to run campaigns, I can see where a majority of the engagement is coming from. And guess what? It's after the fifth contact. It's freaky. It's freaky how accurate this is. So I know you're thinking, really? I didn't know how important follow-up was, right? I, I know this is, I'm stating the obvious. I get it. But we have to state the obvious to understand what the point is here. The point is good follow-up is important. In fact, it's so important that it's given rise to an entirely new industry. I mean, you guys, some of you have seen um, these softwares. How many of you are using at least one, if not more than one, of these softwares right now? Throw me a yes, throw me a whatever in the comments. Let me know. Zing it. This is a two-way texting and maybe appointment reminder Yes, yes, very, yes. Um, uh, appointment reminder software, MailChimp, obviously we're talking about e or, uh, yeah, email, Zapier. This is connects these, these different softwares together. Review Wave, Review Wave is great. Get reviews. Call Rail, call recording, that's awesome. ManyChat, Sly Broadcast, Twilio, these things are all built to help you automate the follow-up process. And they're good tools. But you know what, if you want to use them, it's not going to set itself up, you guys. And by the way, most of you are not just using one of them. Okay. And so to get them set up, man, sometimes, I don't know. I know that you guys have a PhD. I get it. Uh, and, you know, sometimes it's, okay, go ahead and click forgot password for me. What, what seems simple to some is really not that simple. Not to mention the individual cost for each. So maybe you have one, maybe you have several, but if you were to go through these one by one, zing it, 297 a month, MailChimp, depending on your list size, 199 a month, Zapier, uh, I mean, again, this is some, sometimes depending on how many you're sending, uh, 25 bucks a month, Review Wave, 299, Sly Broadcast, 40 bucks, Call Rail, 30, Mini Chat, 50, Twilio, 10, right? It's over 900 bucks right there. And by the way, this is not all of the softwares that are being used by the, by the folks currently on here. This is just an example. Here is the good news, right? And I know um, some of you are like, yeah, I don't have much, much of that or I have one or two of that, but you might be a little relieved when you find out that when it comes to patient stream, that's my logo there on the left. 
I think it's kind of fancy. When it comes to patient training, all of these things, the automation that you're looking at, while important, you don't need any of it, okay? We have all of these things covered for you inside of our platform. That is big savings for anybody using those platforms, okay? So here's what you get. Here's what patient stream provides as part of our platform, pre-built lead follow-up campaigns, okay? That's text, email, voicemail calling, and more bulk emailing, call recording, two-way texting, voice, review automation, scheduling, and more. And what's better is all of the niches, and we went over some of those niches earlier, they have a pre-built uh, follow-up campaign, and it's automated. It's pre-built, it's ready to go for you. Here's an example of what a user might get um, upon coming into your um, follow-up campaign. Hi, John, it's Haley. We look forward to seeing you, whatever date. Please arrive 20 minutes early, and then once that's done, hey, we just wanna confirm you, we've got you going, and then uh, John says, thank you very much. That means new patients come in the door and way less effort, okay? In short, when it comes to automation, we have got you handled. But real quick, some of you may have seen something here. I wanna stop right now, okay? Before we go any further, patient stream, what we brought you is unique, is not something you've ever seen before. It's divided into two, into two parts. One part is lead management. Now, some of you may have seen or are even using this platform, okay, to manage leads, okay? So that's part one. But what patient stream offers is not that. It's not just that. It's also lead generation. And this tool down here is a proprietary to us tool. It's something we created with, I'm not going to say the exact dollar amount, but hundreds of thousands of dollars in development costs and in creating a tool that nobody else could offer. So we took something that the market provided, which was this awesome lead management tool, and we made a hybrid with our lead generation tool that goes inside the, uh, the, uh, the campaign there. You notice in the top of that part one where it says in the bottom right-hand corner, that little P, that P will give you the keys to launching and managing uh, all these campaigns. So, yes, and the library is growing. So hopefully that's fair. I want you guys to see, hey, first of all, we're transparent. I know some of you are using this tool. We're not just giving you a lead management tool. That is a big part, but... This is the biggest part, okay? Part of three, click campaigns and Facebook demo. So remember we went back and we talked about how important it was and the role of proven ads and control phones. Like there's no doubting that that's a big part of it, but what about that effective management part? Well, I think we can show you something pretty convincing to show you how we can actually do this for you. Um, and then let's make sure, uh, is the audio fix on this? Do we know? Okay, let's go ahead. I'm gonna watch, let you guys watch this. this. is a short video. Let's get into it. Hello and welcome to Patient Stream. My name is Sam Carlson and today I'm really excited to show you a really cool demo that we did to show you how powerful Patient Stream can be to helping you run your own ads. Now, let me know if you when we did this, uh, this demo, I thought, hey, this could be cool if we did it. But what would even be better is if somebody who maybe wasn't really tech savvy or familiar with our system, how well could they do it for their first time? So we actually had a new user come in, launch her own ads for the first time. Let's watch and see how she did. And actually, Michelle, would you mind if I just kind of turned it over to you real quick and, sit and let you do this thing? Sure. All right. All right. Once you have copied the URL, you're going to go down here to the bottom right of your computer screen. You're going to click on the button. This will come up. You're going to go down um, to publish Facebook campaigns. Click there. You're going to choose the business that you want to launch the campaign from. So this is our clinic. It's a decompression, so I'm going to choose that. It's going to be knee decompression. I'm going to click here where it says website URL, and I'm going to copy the URL that I grabbed from over here. This is my daily budget 
patient stream always recommends a minimum of 40, but you can adjust that as needed and then simply click launch campaign. <laughs> you You're did done. it. You did it. Right. Cool. So let's jump into the ads manager, if you wouldn't mind. And there it is. Oh, there it is right there. So let's go ahead and we're just going to show people what is set up. What is what the default starting point is. So go ahead and click on the campaign box. Thank you. Uh, once we've clicked on that campaign box, what it's going to do is it's going to isolate that campaign as we click from ad set to ads. So go ahead and click the ad set tab. So we've set it to a conversion campaign. All of the all of the rules and the setup process is done perfectly. But at the ad set level, what is happening is you have four perfect ad sets based on our strategy and the base based on the way we have marketed for several years for perfectly targeted audiences for a local audience. Again, don't forget if you if you have learned about Facebook ads, if you know about Facebook ads, a lot of the people teaching Facebook ads are teaching them for these huge like national campaigns where they're going off and spending a thousand dollars a day or more to audiences that have between a million to two, three million people in it. That is not what we're doing. Okay. So go ahead and we're gonna to go to the ads now. And all of the ads are created as well. Uh, for example, we're doing a knee decompression here. We've been doing knee decompression for long enough to where, I don't know the exact number, Jacob, he could pipe in or he could write in the chat. We probably have anywhere between 15 to 20, maybe more proven ads that will go into the queue. So if one underperforms in your area, we've got another one waiting in the wait, waiting on the ready to come in and fill its place if it underperforms. And really, that's that's it, Michelle. Is there anything else you want to share or say about the process or your feedback or anything like that you want to add to, to uh, this presentation? Um, Sam, I have, as we spoke about yesterday, I have tinkered with Facebook ads in the past for our clinic and um, just through all of the education that I've gotten from the webinars with patient stream I realized that I wasted a lot of time and a lot of money uh, putting campaigns out putting ads out that that just weren't what they needed to be or maybe not spending enough money so um, it was just taking a huge load off of me um, and I'm hoping we are with a different agency that we've been with for a few years. So my hope is that over time I can transfer everything over to AI and not only reach more people, but save a lot of money for our practice. Oh, it looks like it might have frozen. All right, we'll go ahead. Sorry, guys, go ahead and we'll go to the next one. Okay, so <laughs> I guess it's good because in this case, let me make sure that you guys all saw what just happened, all right? There's, I said three clicks, right? So here's how this works. Click number one. Let's make sure you guys saw this right. Click number one, you publish your Facebook campaign. Click, click. Number two, so you choose the condition that you wanna promote. And then click number three is you launch the campaign. All right. And here's what just happened. You launched four proven ads, four proven marketing funnels. Uh, that needs to have an S and then four proven follow-up automation campaigns. All right. And you did that in just three clicks. So when you log into patient stream, you'll click that button. It will create a campaign in Facebook for you. And then you will get new leads. Here is the point. Congratulations. Your front desk just became your new ad agency, or as we like to call her, patient, Pam, our patient automation machine. Tell me that's not amazing.
Tell me that's not, I mean, this is the only place you're going to see uh, this capability, this approach, this way uh, of actually making you guys have the control of your marketing. So let's just review real quick. We know patient stream gives you all these cool follow-up automations. That's awesome. But it also gives you automated Facebook ads. How amazing is that you guys like you've never seen anything like this before. I know because we're the only ones that offer it, but how much of a game changer is this for your practice? Could this be for your practice? Well, here's what some of the users are saying about it. Okay. They, this is uh, Michelle Sims, Northview wellness center, a little Friday encouragement. Patient stream is making a big difference in our practice and in the lives of our people in our community. Our next available new patient appointment is in, the third week of August. Yes, in the midst of COVID, we are completely booked out for the next three weeks. This has never happened, meaning not just in COVID, previously. Thanks again for the quality service. All right, uh, here's Scott, Dr. Scott Walters. They say the highest compliment you can give is a referral uh, and patient stream, specifically Heather and Jacob, that's part of our team, have helped our business launch online marketing campaigns with the click of a button we've been able to drive down our cost per acquisition and reduce our, uh, our marketing overhead by nearly 60% while increased revenue during the COVID pandemic. If you're looking for a turnkey solution for your practice, then sign up for patient stream today. Pretty awesome. And then this is a quick video from Misty. Let's hear, let's see what Hi, my name's Misty. I work for Dr. John Folkerts in Laser Pain Centers of Illinois. We joined Patient Stream just a few months back and have had amazing results with uh, the system. It's super user friendly. Sam and his team are absolutely easy to work with and um, give you the tools to do it yourself. We've spent a lot of money over the years using different agencies trying to get our digital marketing out there to the masses and get our reacts in and get our communication. Um, Sam and Patient Stream they put it all together in a big package for you. You can do it all by yourself. Um, it's amazing to know that what you're spending is working and the money that we used to spend on agency fees and this and that and everything else, we are now able to put into Facebook ad spend. So um, it's been amazing. We're looking forward to our future with Patient Stream and thanks Sam and your team for all your hard work. Cool. Uh, here, here's the punchline, you guys. If you want a, a very simple way to look at what patient stream can do for your practice, it's basically like a hinge. It's a small hinge that swings a large door. It allows you to leverage our proven marketing campaigns from ads to funnels to everything else we have and take control of your marketing once and for all. That's what we're here for. That's what the mission is. And that's what we're trying to do. So let me ask you a question from what you've seen so far. Has this been valuable? Let me know in the comments, grab that chat, light it up. Let me know you guys, uh, has, has this been valuable, <laughs> valuable Dr. Chad? Yeah. Yeah, buddy. That's, pretty awesome. That's what I'm talking about. Let me see you guys light it up. Let's see what you got. All right. Yes. Wonderful. Okay, cool. Let's do a quick recap. So here's what we've seen. We've seen proven ads and control funnels, niche specific marketing, both the framework, the process, and some actual examples. We've seen marketing automation and follow-up. Uh, I mean, literally with what we give you, you'll plug into it. You don't have to create it. And you're gonna stop chasing leads and improve your show rates. And then we've shown you how easy it is to launch your own Facebook ads. And I know anytime we're in these new trainings, it's overwhelming, right? I'm guessing this past hour, a lot of you feel like this, right? I'm guessing that this is overwhelming. Let me ask you this question. Hopefully, this is a fair question. How would you like to plug into patient stream? And let me put a finer point on what that means. How would you like to get started with patient stream? This means that you would get the com complete access to all of our software as well as our Facebook AI. You'd get all the ads, proven funnels, and, uh, and uh, marketing niches, you'd get the pre-built uh, follow-up campaign and automation, and then you also would get free weekly trainings and on-demand tutorials. We have a ton of trainings that we do every single week. I think uh, this week we've done four trainings in our group, okay? You get that on-demand, either you, yourself, 
uh, your staff can come in and get educated on different marketing things, all included with what we're doing here. Not to mention, remember all this cool stuff, all the automation you needed, all those amazing agencies you got to um, interact with, engage with. Not anymore. Getting started with Patient Stream means you get to replace all of that in one place. But before we go any further, our program, like I said at the beginning of this, it's not for everybody. It really isn't. Um, the, the program isn't for people who are looking just for a gimmick, right? Patient Stream is not a gimmick. I'm not showing you something that we just kind of created to, you know, throw some sizzle. It's a true system. It works amazing. Um, our program is for people who can commit time, even though it's minimal, but you have to implement, right? If you've got a, if you go and you buy this awesome screw gun and you want to, you know, do a honeydew project or whatever, you actually got to pick that screw gun up and use it. Okay. It's the same thing here. Those who see value in using our proven materials and not interested in reinventing the wheel. Meaning if you want to try and become your own cute kind of marketer, Patient stream is not the system for you. Okay. You can go, I mean, they're your marketing dollars. You can go and guess. I mean, that's fine. We use proven marketing campaigns that we know work and we give them to you. Okay. This is for people ready to take control of their marketing. Okay. Now this has been awesome. I have fun doing these presentations. Hopefully you guys have fun, uh, you know, until now just seeing what is possible for your practice. But I know a lot of you are saying, okay, cool. Well, this sounds good, but maybe even a little too good. What about the money? Well, I mean, a lot of you are paying at least $1,500 a month. Some as much as I talked to one guy that was paying $8,000 a month for Facebook ad uh, advertising, not, not including ad spend, just the agency. So a lot of you are paying uh, $1,500 a month. And what's worse, <laughs> I hate to rub salt in the wound because there's people on this call that definitely have done this. A lot of you doing most of their job for them. You're doing most of it for them. With Patient Stream, you'll have everything you need to run the campaigns yourself. And you don't even have to get into Facebook. You can run it all yourself, okay? So let me ask you this. What would you pay for the following? To have proven ads guaranteed to get clicks be able to take, to take control when you're at, uh, be able to take control of your ads, the conditions you want to run, even if you don't know a dang thing about Facebook, plug into pre-built follow-up automation and honestly be able to replace your post and pray agency once and for all. That sounds like you. We got something pretty cool for you. Here's what's great about patient stream. We don't charge you 1500 bucks a month. We don't charge you a thousand. We don't charge you 600. You get all of those things, everything we've talked about in patient stream for just $397 a month. Okay. $397 a month is all it costs to take control of your marketing, to have access to patient stream, to have access to all the niches we've created as well as the ones that we are creating every single week. So let me just make sure that you understand what you're getting. Okay. Let's go through that one more time. Click campaigns. You're getting those pre-built follow-up and reactivation campaigns. Oh, we didn't talk about reactivation campaigns. We've got reactivation campaigns pre-built so you can go in and make money off of old leads as well as past patients. Those are built and ready to go. Two-way texting, okay? So if you're using, using a two-way texting service, you can cancel that. You've got two-way texting right here. Call recording, voicemail broadcasting, that's all included. Automated reviews, unlimited access to all niches within patient stream. We're not gonna limit you to one or two. You have access to all of them, scheduling and, and appointment reminders, staff trainings every single week, library of past sales and marketing training, and free admission into our patient stream users group. It's pretty great. It's a pretty big group. It's growing all the time. Our users are amazing folks. In fact, they're the kind of people that if you want to take control of your marketing, if you want to take control of your business, you want to be around these people. Okay. Let me give you an idea real quick. I know a lot of people, this is a question also that they're kind of wondering, okay, how long does it take to get started? Um, what does that look like? Well, it's pretty simple, really, okay? So step number one is sign up. So sign up, we'll activate your patient stream account and get you connected. And you can actually launch your first Facebook campaign within 15 minutes, 
Okay, that is our goal. Uh, we've got, a, we've got a, a process that we take you through right when you sign up and you can launch your ads within 15 minutes, okay? Once you've done that, then we go, we, we kind of parcel it apart over the first week onboarding process. We've got three short tutorials, okay? And when I say short, we're talking about over uh, the period of the week, you can do all three of these tutorials in less than an hour, all right? And you go over them and you're good to go, okay? And then once you've done that, once you've gone through and you have broad utility of the platform, I shouldn't say broad, you have uh, the 80% utility of the platform, then that 20% that's left over, we call that next level use. We got weekly trainings, we have on-demand learning, we have amazing support to help you get started. Okay, uh, Ed, I see your question. I'll answer that question here in just a second. Okay, what about guarantee? Well, let's talk about guarantee. Let me, I, and maybe some of you uh, know this clip, but let's watch this real quick. I'm listening. Here's the way I see it, Ted. Guy puts a fancy guarantee in a box because he wants you to feel all warm and toasty inside. Yeah, makes a man feel good. Of course it does. Why shouldn't it? You figure you put that little box under your pillow at night, the guarantee fairy might come by and leave a quarter. Am I right, Ted? <laughs> What's your point? The point is, how do you know the fairy isn't a crazy glue sniffer? Building model airplanes, says the little fairy. Well, we're not buying it. He sneaks into your house once, that's all it takes. Next thing you know, there's money missing off the dresser and your daughter's knocked up. I've seen it a hundred times. But why do they put a guarantee on the box then? Because they know all they sold you was a guaranteed piece of shit. That's all it is, isn't it? Hey, if you want me to take a dump in a box and mark it guaranteed, I will. I got spare time. But for now, for your customer's sake, for your daughter's sake, you might want to think about buying a quality product from me. Okay, I'll buy from you. Oh, that's... What? <laughs> I know that's... Uh, I love that show. That was one of the best movies ever. But uh, anyway, uh, listen, at the end of the day, there's a lot of guys going out there and, and making these weird guarantees. They're, they're guaranteeing things that are out of their control, which make no sense. And the reality is, is it's, it's a shell game. It's, it's a move. They're, they're, you know, in my opinion, and I've spoken with plenty of you to know that this is the case. They're making some commitments, some promises, and they're shirking I mean, at the end of the day, they're not saving you any money. They're not saving you any money. They're not really doing what they say they're doing. Okay. So here's our special deal for you today. So obviously we're, we're here with Dr. Wilner. We're not just going to come here and bring nothing to the table. So here's what I want to offer to everybody here on the call today, because I believe so much in what patient stream is and what it's doing and how awesome it is. I'm going to give you the ability to try it for free for seven days. Okay. Get in. If you, I mean, we've made some pretty bold claims, and I know the the what we've shown and, and tried to really show. We've shown proof, but at the same time, sometimes just getting in and having an opportunity to try it out for yourself is what people need. So, I, and they, they need yeah, to know what can happen in seven days in patient training. Absolutely, like you can generate new patients within that time frame. You can generate new patients. Like yeah. I've, I've done a patient stream campaign where we set it up and. Within an hour or two, we had a, a new lead. Like, yeah. Yep. It's, it's that, I mean, it's, it's pretty rad. So just so they kind of have some context there, seven days gives them enough time to really test it out and see for themselves. Absolutely. Put, you know? Absolutely. And it gives them, it gives them that, that belief, that, that ability to, to say, hey, okay, I can do this. I don't need, oh, uh, Josh K said they can't hear you. Say it one more time. <laughs> oh, I, was, I was just saying what you guys could do in seven days is pretty powerful. You guys could be generating uh, new patients well within that time frame. We've, we've had a, a campaign inside a patient stream where we were generating new leads that resulted in new patients within, I don't know, a couple hours uh, after setting it up. So it was, it's, it's fast. I mean, it gets things up and running really, really fast. So just so they, so that docs understand like what that seven day time frame means. Smart. Like that means a lot. You can generate and see for yourself the value that's there. Yeah. And, 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 and that being said too, I, I hope docs understand are calculating in their mind, like at 397 a month, how many, new, and I'm being very realistic here. How many new patients would you need to be generating 
for that to financially make sense, 397 a month. Yeah. Like I am confident that this can pay for itself, uh, you know, 10 times over truly with, with what it's, what it's able to provide you in terms of new patients, making it a no brainer. So, yeah. Awesome. Uh, okay. So, uh, so try it for, uh, again, I believe in it so much. I'm going to let you try it for seven days. After that, it's just 397 a month. Okay. No contract. Um, there is an act activation slash licensing thing. However, 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 big, however, I'm going to waive that. So long as you go to mypatientstream.com forward slash pricing, and when you check out, use the code Cairo Funnels. If you use the code Cairo Funnels, I will waive that licensing fee. It's a licensing fee more so than it is an activation fee, but we'll waive that for Cairo Funnels folks. Okay. So absolutely um, 100%, uh, you know, try it out and try it before you buy, basically, right? Um, now I'm going to jump into a couple of quick questions. I know we've had them coming in. Uh, thank you guys for holding those questions until the end. That does kind of help the, the momentum here. Okay, so um, let's see here. So Ed says, what about Facebook changing their algorithms periodically? That's a great question. Um, I guess there's two things to consider. Understand first and foremost that Facebook's algorithm changes, when they're talking about big algorithm changes, that is affecting mostly these huge marketing campaigns. You're talking about companies like, I don't know, companies that are running campaigns to millions of people. When we do local marketing campaigns, it's to 80,000 to 150,000 people. It's not the same. In fact, patient stream used the exact same um, approach that we had in our agency to optimize and manage these campaigns. It, it's, it's systemized and made those rules part of its algorithm. So even, um, in fact, right now we're, we're starting into the third quarter. When is the third? What, I didn't know what day it is. Third quarter. Is it November 1st? Maybe November. We might be in the third quarter. I know right now a lot of people are concerned about changes, uh, recent changes in Facebook. Um, even if there were changes that were affecting our results, uh, we have the ability to, you know, that's, that's the beauty of owning the code. We can make whatever changes necessary to, uh, to, to counteract that. And then Chris says, you have any functional medicine slash nutrition campaigns? Great question. So um, like I said, patient stream is coming out with new conditions all the time. Uh, probably within Actually, I think next week we have a thyroid offer coming out. Um, it's a thyroid offer that we've, that we've used before. So that will be coming out. Um, we're also able to, if you have something that has worked in your market and you can prove to me that it has worked, what's cool about patient stream is first of all, you can send it to me. I can look at it, make sure that it falls within our criteria of working in other markets and I can put it into our system. In fact, I put uh, I had a guy do that this last week. He had a, he had this offer. It was really cool. He did knee decompression and laser and it was crushing it in his market. And we went through it. I said, this is a great offer. One I hadn't considered before. I'll, I'll create our own patient stream spin on it and I'll put it in there. Okay. So if you've got something that, that works, let me know. We can certainly take a look at it. Um, do we create the email follow-up drips or do you? So Shandon, um, remember I talked about those follow-up campaigns. Those follow-up campaigns, they come to you pre-built. They include text, they include email, and you can include other things in there, but they're pre-built. Now, I tell all of our users to go in and, I mean, the reality is, is you can use what we have in there, but if you go in and make it your own, add your pictures, add your testimonials, it's going to become better. So what we do is we just have people go in and, and use what we already have and then just, you know, customize it, personalize it. That's probably a better word. Okay. Um, how about dementia, post-concussion, migraines? Dementia and post-concussion. This is a very interesting question. So uh, I guess my, my question back to you, Chris, would be, uh, what are you using as far as a protocol for dementia? We have an ADD slash ADHD one that uses brain mapping, um, uh, neurofeedback uh, as, the, as the novel tool. It works really good. I know some people 
are using things along those lines for concussion or whatever, what have you. If you have something that works, I'd be happy to discuss it with you, but we don't have anything currently for dementia. All right, and then we've had a couple of people coming into the Q&A. Uh, okay. Is a chatbot part of the platform? Uh, no bots. Um, we don't have any bots currently, and quite frankly, I hate chatbots. Uh, many chat, by the way, many chats, I don't know how long it started to go, two years ago, something like that. It's, it, yeah, in many chat, who's like the leader in bot stuff, they, I, I looked into it for, yeah, this is going to sound super arrogant, what I'm about to say, and I don't mean it to sound this way, but I think I'm usually a pretty good judge of, you know, new trends in marketing in terms of what's going to be a winner and, and prove the test of time. And as far as I'm concerned, bots have not done that. Bots have been this, there was, I think, just way too much hype and excitement right. over them. And, and the problem was, is that I, I don't know, it's just, and so I have many chat, I grew the list, but now they have so many ridiculous restrictions on how you can send messaging, when you can send messaging. And now it's all of a sudden become this like pay to play platform. Even though you pay a monthly fee, you now also have to pay on top to send out message blasts through the, it's, it's, to me, I'm, I'm about ready to cancel my, my mini chat. So that's, <laughs> that's my feeling on bots. Sorry if that hurts anybody's. I know there, there, there seems to be a lot of cachet around certain things. And, uh, I was excited about mini chat when it came out. Uh, it has not lived up to the hype. And a part of that is just, uh, how frightened Facebook is of messenger turning into, your email, like the spam email that comes in. So they've created a lot of regulation around that. So Brad, hopefully that answers your question. Uh, Gary asks, any pregnancy campaigns? We actually do have a pregnancy campaign. Um, it's not programmed in, into the system yet, but uh, you're now reminding me to get it uploaded. So we've got a campaign that does extremely well. Um, we, we have a local doc here, a friend of both Dr. Woolner and myself, who has crushed it with pregnancy. And so we do have a proven campaign for that. So I would expect to see that inside of patient stream within the next two weeks. Okay. Is it HIPAA compliant? Yes. The platform is HIPAA compliant. Okay. Uh, headaches. So as far as headaches, um, we had a campaign there that did really well for headaches. It hasn't produced that well in recent, uh, in recent times. So we took it out. I mean, the reality is if it's not working, if a campaign isn't working, I remove it. The assumption is if, it, if, they're cam if the campaigns are in patient stream, they've been proven to work. Or I will tell you, hey, this is in beta. Try it. Um, and then, you know, we'll update it as we go forward. So headache, we used to have it, used to work good, kind of faded away. So don't have anything right now, but we'd love to know if somebody does. Um, can we make and post our own campaigns or do we use yours? Uh, so, you know, patient stream, again, um, if you want to get out, and be creative and create your own campaigns. Patient stream is not about that. We want to give you the ability to launch campaigns with proven, proven elements, proven ads and campaigns. So if you have something that you want to run, um, you can run it from, you know, you can post stuff to your Facebook page, but not through, uh, not through patient stream. How do we, how do we get weight loss through face weight loss through Facebook guards? Oh, Gary. Well, Gary, uh, the nice thing about, uh, what we do here at patient stream is that I don't have to keep my secrets. Uh, I would say that, uh, we share all this stuff inside of our group. If you have questions like this, come into the group because I'm sure you want to know, but the reality is, is don't focus on weight loss, right? Uh, there's, there are some definite no-nos to saying weight loss. So just don't, don't, you know, play chess, not checkers. That, that being said, you can get weight loss patients. Oh yeah. Yeah. We crush weight loss patients. Yeah. Yeah. You have to, you have to change the angle again, play, play chess, not checkers. What comes before the weight loss? What's the conversation? What's the interest? What's the, what's the intrigue before the weight loss? Okay, uh, Josh says, our clinic has spinal decompression laser and low, lo low level light therapy. Uh, would you suggest the top converting ads or will we need to do trial and error? Well, okay, so remember, remember I talked about one of the angle, one of the things on um, the marketing triad is your, your marketing needs to be, needs to solve a problem. So when you say you have laser, you have to frame your thing in the context of a, 
around their problem. I have, I have uh, campaigns that work on all of these. Laser, you wanna do plantar fasciitis? Use, you know, try the laser campaign for plantar fasciitis. Um, spinal decompression, it's pretty straightforward. It's not about the modality, it's about how that modality will improve the life of the patient, of the end user of said modality, right? So uh, laser, uh, pulse wave, right? Or the acoustic wave or whatever that is, the shock wave therapy, uh, PEMF, yeah. decompression, uh, neurofeedback, biofeedback, uh, well, yeah. flow tanks, I mean, any cryo chambers, you name the modality, but at the end of the day, how does that modality help the end user? And that's what's being conveyed. And that's the beautiful part about patient stream is that you've got it to where they're, they're engineering these things in such a way to, to fit it in a way that, that you can utilize those modalities, but it's, it's communicated to, correct, to the end user correctly and, and effectively by focusing on what they're interested in, right? Yeah, exactly. That was a good question, Josh. By the way, I know it's it, like in the presentation, I know I went over that. We probably only spent 30 seconds on it. Right. So it's not like just because we we cover some of this, I don't expect you guys to get it from the get go. Hopefully you just feel comfortable and assured that we know what we're talking about. We've been doing this for a long time and, um, you know, we know what we're doing. So it uh, looks like uh, we're pretty good on questions. Guys, go to mypagestream.com forward slash pricing. Use that code Cairo Funnels. Um, get signed up. What do you have to lose? Seven day freeze. Uh, seven day free. You'll get a, once you log on, you'll get a video. It will walk you through how to get going. Um, oh, as far as Gary concussion, nothing for concussion right now, Gary. Um, yeah. I mean, if, if we, again, it's the same thing. If, if somebody has an approach that works for concussion and it falls inside of my marketing triad, I'll put something together because I, I mean, I, that's probably my favorite part of doing this is I love creating those offers. That's, that's, uh, uh, okay. So I was just able to join. Can the present, can the presentation be emailed to me? Oh <laughs> yes, Vanessa. Uh, we will have a, uh, a replay. Now we'll say the Cairo funnels offer is not good forever. Okay. We are going to take this offer down. So don't wait. And, uh, it, you know, we're going to waive your, we're going to waive your activation fee and we're giving you seven days free to give it a shot. So uh, any other questions before, before we take off here? I appreciate all the awesome questions here. It looks like we had quite a few come in. Um, so thank you guys so much. Um, and, oh, <laughs> Vanessa is on a flight. How about that? Well, thanks for coming, Vanessa. That's, uh, that shows some commitment, so I appreciate it. So guys, thanks again. Um, and with that, Dr. Will, you want to say anything in parting here? Get signed up, guys. Seriously, give it a shot. Seven days, you got nothing to lose um, and everything to gain with this offer. Patient Stream is, a, is an amazing platform. Uh, I go way back with Sam. Uh, if you guys have followed me for any period of time, you know Sam and I uh, have been working together on various projects and in various um, ways. And all I can say is that docs would be crazy not to jump in on this. So seriously, jump in on this get in on it. It's going to make a big difference in your practice, especially if you use it, <laughs> right? So jump in on it. Take advantage of the docs. All right, guys. Thanks so much for giving us your time. Appreciate it. And uh, we will see you inside the patient stream.